take a moment. See yourself sitting here. Close your eyes, make yourself comfortable. We're good grow down into the earth, but through our feet. So we're going to grow roots out of our feet, pushing down through the floor, down through the basement, into the earth, far beneath us. And push these roots down into the earth, the cool earth far below us. It starts searching, going around the rocks, going around the boulders. Keep on going down till you hit the bedrock far below you. When you hit there, reach out and search. Try to find the cool, crisp waters far beneath the earth. When you find them, dip your roots into them and slowly bring this cool water up into our bodies with each and every breath. Bring that water further and further up. Bring it up into your feet. Feel the cool water center and feel them run up into your legs and into your loins. Feel these waters cool you down as you bring them up further into your belly. With each and every breath, bring the waters further and further into your chest, into your head. Until finally, as you take another breath, Pull the waters up, have them come out of your head and out of your hands, flowing back into the earth. Feel these waters moving throughout your body, filling you with these energies of chaos from below, these powers of potential. Drink of these waters and fill yourself with all the energies from here that you need. Then now we're gonna turn our focus up. We're gonna grow our branches, grow them up through the ceilings, grow them up through the roofs, up into the sky, and push them up high through the sky. If there are clouds, they go up through the clouds until we can find that one star directly above our heads. We're going to reach up for that star. We're going to pull down from that star the light and fire from above fires of order. We bring these fires down slowly into our branches. Let them warm our branches up like the water's cooled our roots. I feel this, this fire come down slowly to bring it in into our heads and into our hands. Feel these fires warm us up as they come down into our chest, mingling with the waters from below. Bring these fires further down into our bellies and into our loins. Feel yourself fill with these fires from above and the waters from below. And keep on bringing the fires down through our legs until they're down all the way into our feet. And feel these powers mingling within our bodies. Order and chaos, fire and water, the powers of potential mixing throughout our bodies. Drink deep of the waters, drink deep of the fires. Fill yourself up with these powers until you bring yourself to your normal center. And then bring just a little bit more in. Fill yourself with these powers so you're prepared for the ritual, so you're back to yourself. And when you're ready, push the waters back down. Push the fires back up. Feel what you have drunk in, fill yourself. And know if you ever need more, you can always reach down, you can always reach up. But for now, push them away and disconnect. Bring your branches in, bring your roots in. And when you're ready, take a deep breath in out, in, and out. When you're ready, open your eyes, prepare for the ritual.
our first offering, as always, is to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you surround us, you support us. With you, you provide us all the food, all the shelter we could ever use. With you, you also provide us all the weather, some of which we wish you would stop. We're not due, like all the rains that Texas and Louisiana are going to be getting soon. But we know that's part of your cycles. So Earth Mother, for all that you do for us, we say, Earth Mother, accept our offerings. Earth, Earth Spirit, Mother, accept, accept our, our offerings. offerings. We're here to honor the gods, the land spirits, and the ancestors. And we're here to ask for all their blessings in return. But first, let us hallow our hallows. Mighty Wells, you run deep into the earth, to the lands and the ancestors. You are our connection and our gateway to the ancestors. We offer you the silver. We say, sacred waters flow within us. Sacred waters flow within sacred us. Sacred waters flow within us. And mighty fire, you burn and transform. You send our offerings high into the sky, to the lands of the shining ones. We offer you the incense. We say, sacred fires burn within us. Sacred, Sacred fires, fires burn, burn within, within us. The mighty tree, the roots run deep, far into the earth. They reside in the wells of the ancestors far below. May your branches run high into the sky and dwell in the lands of the shining ones far above. We give you water and we give you incense. We say, sacred tree, grow within us. Sacred tree, tree grow, grow within, within us. us. I grow within and all of our groves, by the might of the waters and the light of the fires. Our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the waters and the light of the fires, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the waters and the light of the fires, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. So be it. Next, we call on the gatekeepers. To the gatekeepers all, you who have aided us in the past, we call on you once more and ask you once more to do the jobs of the gatekeepers. Watch over us as we walk your holy roads. Guide us and show us where to go. Take our messages far and wide and bring back to us what we need to hear. For all that we ask of you, gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Gatekeepers, gatekeepers accept, accept our, our offerings. offerings. And now, mighty gatekeepers, in my house, in, in each and every one of our houses, join your magic with ours. Let the wells open as gates to the underworld. Let the fires open as gates to the upper worlds. Let the trees be the crossroads between all the worlds, open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Let the gates be opened. Let it be opened in each and every one of our houses. First, let's make offerings to the ancestors. To all of you who have come before our family, we offer you welcome. To all of you who we have chosen as friends, as inspiration, as mentors, our chosen family, we offer you welcome. And to all of you in this very earth, you who are here long before us, and you will be here long after. 
we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fires. Ancestors, accept our offerings. Ancestors, accept our offerings. And to the land spirits, you fur and feather, scale and skin, our animal kin, we offer you welcome. Be you leaf and twig, stem and flower, our plant kin, we offer you welcome. And to all of you who are the unseen, our house spirits, our land spirits, we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. Land, land spirits, spirits accept, accept our offerings. Accept our offerings. Shining ones, gods and goddesses of elder days, you who watch over each and every one of us, our matrons, our patrons, we offer you welcome. To those of you of this very earth, you who are here watching over this place, we offer you welcome. And to all the unknown, you who watch over each and every one of us, but are not known by us, we offer you welcome. Come and join us at our fires. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Shining, Shining ones, accept, accept our offerings. At this point, if anyone has offerings they wish to make to any of the kindred, feel free to make them. Watch over those that are in or about to be in natural disasters. May the flooding be minor. May the destruction be minor. Watch over them nonetheless. There are no further offerings to be made. Mighty kindred, we have given to you, and we give to you one last time. We ask that when we give you this, that you bless us in return. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. Mighty kindred, accept, accept our, sac our sacrifice. And mighty kindred, we now ask what blessings do you return? To the ancestors. Ancestors, what blessings do you give? Think of this lagus. Waters, emotions. And land spirits, what blessings do you give? Think of this yara, the ruin of cycles, of harvest. The shining ones, what blessings do you get? They give us two. They first give us A was the horse. Spiritual journey, spiritual practice. And they give us hoggle, hail and change. This is interesting in how it's coming across to me. I'm reading it as water gives you crops. Water's, water's produced the harvest. But as we saw in the Midwest this year, waters can destroy the harvest too. Remember that with your spiritual practice. Doing the work is good, but doing it wrong or doing it inconsistent can cause other problems. I think this is a cautionary omen to remind us to take our practice serious. 
Do we accept the summon? We do. Accept the summon. Okay, ancient and mighty ones. We have given to you and we've asked for a gift in return. And you have given us these blessings. We now ask that you fill each and every one of our waters. Fill them with the blessings we have just heard. Fill them with the waters of the ancestors. Fill them with the harvest of the land spirits. Fill them with the spiritual practice and the change that can come with it from these shining ones. Fill these waters in each and every one of our houses. Behold the waters of life. Behold, Behold the waters, the waters of, life. of life. All right. Now let us thank all of those who have aided us. Shining ones, be you our patrons and matrons, be you of this place or be you unknown. For the omens you have given, or help you give throughout the weeks. Shining ones, we thank you. Shining, Shining ones, ones, we, thank, we you. thank you. To the land spirits, be you the animal kin, which have behaved well in my house today. Be you the plant kin, or be you the unseen kins, for all that you do for us throughout the weeks, for the omens you have given us today. Land spirits, we thank you. Land, Land spirits, spirits, we thank, thank you. you. And to the ancestors, be your family, be your chosen family or be you of this very earth for all that you have done for us throughout the weeks, for the omens that you have given us today. Ancestors, we thank you. Ancestors, Ancestors we, we thank, thank you. And gatekeepers, you have aided us once more, brought back to us these omens, and allowed us to do our work safely. For all of that, Gatekeepers all, we thank you. Gatekeepers all, we, we thank, thank you. you. And once more, we ask that you join your magic with ours in each and every one of our houses. Let the wells become but waters. Let all the fires become but flames. Let all the trees become but trees once more. Let the gates be closed. Oh, let the gates be closed. And last but not least, to the Earth Mother. You surround us, you support us, you house us, you feed us. Without you, we would not be here. For all that you do for us, Earth Mother, we thank you. Earth Spirit, we thank you. And now, go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace, for this right has ended.